Sports news now. The trophy of the much-awaited Indian Super League was finally unveiled in a glittering ceremony in Mumbai. The league will kick start on the 12th of this month where Saurabh Ganguly's team will host Ranbir Kapoor's Mumbai City FC. The wait for a top-class footballing league in the country is over. The Indian Super League is finally here. Aiming to change the face of Indian football. ISL's trophy was unveiled in a star-studded ceremony in Mumbai. I dedicate this trophy to the youth of India with the earnest hope that this league will motivate the young Indians to be amongst the best in the world in the coming years and decades. The star signings of the ISL added spark to the already glittering ceremony and they will hit the ground running in a week's time. Uh, Sachin Tendulkar, I mean, worldwide legend. Uh, some people might even argue a bit of a god, uh, but also a fantastic sportsman and someone who appreciates the value of the opportunity of sport for people at every different level and the grassroots opportunities that the ISL can give. Many people were telling us that Kolkata is probably the, the city where the, the, the people feel a lot more the passion of the football and, and we saw it in just one week. Uh, we could see it uh, on the streets, uh, on the malls, everywhere we were going. Even if we had the, the Durga Puja and we had a big holiday, all the people is looking forward to, to this uh, ISL. I think uh, we have a really good team. Uh, so it's very important because the, um, the Indian player uh, they make uh, yeah they make a success for the for the future. We try to do our best for be to do a, to be an inspiration for the guys and uh, to share with them our knowledge and uh, to play football. When the league hit the ground running a few weeks ago, fear was it would attract largely retired stars well past their prime. But action soon picked up pace, with many big and competitive names adding to the tally. They are still stars of years gone by. But with the likes of Anelka joining, star-starved Indian public can look forward to some big names competing on Indian soil. That's the USP of this league, not its star owners, but star players on the field. Can it really do what the IPL did? It will all depend on the quality of the action. The countdown has begun. Come October 12th, East will meet West. As Soros Atletico de Kolkata hosts Ranbir's Mumbai FC. The football fanatics across the country are ready. It's time for football. Sports Bureau, headlines today.